Oh, hello, Kira Kids. How I? Hang on a minute. Oh, hey there, Kira Kids. How are you? It's so good to see you. Today we are talking about the fruit of the spirit, gentleness. That's uh, that's Tommy Tomato up there. What? He's pretty gentle. At least he is now. Gentleness. Oh. Yeah, great. Um, so, there's a verse in Philippians 4 verse 5. Let me read it to you. It says, Let everyone see that you are gentle and kind. Hmm. And then in Ephesians 4 verse 2, it says, Always be humble and gentle. Be patient with each other, making allowance for each other's faults because of your love. So these are words that we can find in the Bible that are saying, Hey, you need to be gentle. It's one of the fruits of the Spirit, and these words are saying we should be gentle. So, what's that all about? Well, you know, if, I, if I'm if i not gentle with this egg, if I throw it around, or like just dump it on the ground somewhere, or um, even if I just chuck it onto the bench, this egg's not going to last that long. I need to really look after this egg if I want it to stay uncracked. Just like an egg, Imagine baby chicks. You wouldn't just chuck a baby chick around, would you? You have to be gentle with them. Oh. Here's the great part. Gentleness is a strength. It's... Wow. It's almost like a superpower. It's a really, really powerful thing. So gentleness doesn't mean being weak. Gentleness doesn't mean just being a pushover or doing whatever anyone else thinks all the time. Um, gentleness means that you can speak and you can act in a way that others can receive. When you love Jesus, that will be shown through your gentleness. So this week, have a think about how God can help you develop gentleness in your life, both in the words that you say and the things that you do. Hey, let me pray for you now. Jesus, thank you so much for every single one of these kids. Thank you that you love them. Thank you that you are with them always. We ask now that you would help us to develop this gift of gentleness, that we could be kind with the words that we say, that we could be gentle with the things that we do. Bless our kids, bless their families, give them an amazing week. In Jesus' name, Amen. Have a great week! <laughs>